Welcome to my channel. I'm Zhang Jingxu. Let's work on the problem 27 in chapter 4. In this one, we look at this system. So we have two objects. We give it a mark. This is number 1. This is number 2. Okay. And then these two connected by a cable. In this one, we can see uh, it asks us to determine the force that the table acts on the box. So the normal force, right? If the weight, this, this M2 is in three cases. Uh, 30 newtons, 60 newtons, and 90 newtons. The first thing I suggest to you is do the force analysis. So first one, we look at the number one. For number one, the force, force acting on it must be gravity. It is given the weight, right? Uh, 77 newton. And then this one, the normal force, the table act on this number one. And then the second force by the cable, Ft, do you agree? Yes. Then we look at the number two. For number two, the force acting must be gravity. The next one, the force from the cable, Ft. So this F, this two must equal because this two force come from the string. This is same cable. From Newton's third law, this force must be equal. Do you agree? Yeah. And then we can write Newton's second law. For Newton's second law, we look at number one. So we can see Ft plus F1 minus M, the gravity M1g equals zero because this uh, system keeps stationary, so acceleration is zero. The number two, we look at it, we see Ft minus M2g equals zero, zero, agree? And Ft and Ft are equal. Therefore, we can get the normal force. The table act on the number one is M1g minus M2g, and then we are done. You just input M1 and M2 inside, then you are done. Thank you. See, this is how we do the calculations for different uh, M2 this way. Thank you.